Hi guys, it's Brittany with Pamper Me Posh. You can find me on Facebook at Brittany's Perfectly Posh Pampering. And today I'm going to show you how I put my mask on using a brush. Um, so a lot of you might be wondering why brush instead of your fingers. Um, for one, it puts the product on a lot more smoothly and in a nice thin layer across the face versus your fingers which will kind of leave it um, a little clumpy. You you'll get some really thick in one spot and really thin in another and um, this also helps to you know preserve your product and make it last longer since um, you really don't need a whole lot because our ingredients are so fresh and so natural um, a little bit really does go a long way so a thin layer is really all you need to get that really good feeling and that really deep treatment of a mask on your face so today I'm using our Calling All Fairies mask. This was a limited edition item. Um, you can't buy it in the store anymore. They were available over the holidays during a whiteout sale um, for everybody to purchase and they went pretty quickly. Um, it is a sponge sugar glycolic face mask and it has witch hazel, cranberry, and raspberry. It doesn't really have like a very berry scent to me, um, but it is pretty thick. And I'm just gonna actually use just what's in the top here because there's so much. Um, so I'm just gonna lightly put it on. I'm gonna start at the top and work my way down. And this mask you leave on for five to 15 minutes depending on um, your skin type. If you have sensitive skin, I don't recommend leaving it on very long. Um, and definitely test it in the crook of your elbow before applying to make sure um, you're not gonna have any reaction to it. Um, another thing is because it does have the glycolic um, acid in it, you don't want to um, use an exfoliating face wash after this. Um, this is going to do the exfoliation for you. So you just want to let it, you know, clean and remove the dead skin cells and then you just want to wash it off gently. Um, and if you do want to use a face wash, I would use, you know, something like our Delish or our Pore Effect, nothing with the scrubby aspect to it because you're not going to need it and then of course follow up with a really good moisturizer like our night and day or our moisture 911 all right so my whole face is covered and a nice thin layer everywhere and I only used what was sitting in the top of the container nothing from the actual